If you're dealing with Crohn's, lupus, Hashimoto's, celiac, or any other autoimmune diseases, these five peptides could help you heal from the inside out. First up, we're gonna talk about TB500. This peptide accelerates healing, regenerates tissue, and reduces systemic inflammation. It helps repair the gut lining, key for autoimmune and GI diseases. The benefits are gonna be regenerative healing, gut and tissue repair, as well as inflammation reduction. We're looking at a dosing of about two to five milligrams subcutaneously one to two times weekly. Next is thymosin alpha one. This peptide helps regulate your immune system instead of suppressing it. This is great for people with autoimmunity as well as chronic infections. Benefits of this include immune modulation, fewer flare-ups, and better resilience. The dose of this is gonna be about 1.5 milligrams subcutaneously two to three times a week. Peptide number three is our favorite, BPC-157. It's the ultimate gut repair peptide. It seals up a leaky gut, it calms inflammation, and supports your entire gut immune axis. Benefits include gut lining repair, it's gonna reduce GI inflammation, and it's gonna support autoimmune recovery. Peptide number four is gonna be LL37. It's a host defensive peptide that works like a natural antimicrobial, so it's gonna clear chronic infections that often trigger autoimmune flare-ups. Some of its benefits are it's antibacterial and antiviral, it's immune balancing, and gut, it's got great gut and skin support. We're looking at about a dose of about 100 to 500 micrograms subcutaneously, one to three times weekly. And last but not least is KPV. It's a tiny peptide with a huge anti-inflammatory power. It reduces cytokines like TNF-alpha and interleukin-6, which are key drivers in autoimmune attacks. Its benefits include that it targets gut and skin inflammation, it calms immune overactivation, it's also safe and non-immunosuppressive. Dosing-wise, we're looking at about